Come on, buddy. Dang it. These things are actually coming after me. They're no joking. <laughs> no way. I think we're gonna have to get to the coffee in order to get better. Hold up. Alright, uh, let's just grab the arm now. Look at that, we got it. Hello everybody and welcome back to Lair of the Clockwork Gods. My name is of course Constantine and uh, we have returned back with our two heroes here. Uh, back to carry on the adventure. Now, in the previous episode, uh, we managed to get inside the code here. <laughs> Not quite sure what this is all about. Uh, this definitely looks like Matrix, I could say. Uh, let's just try to climb up here and see what we can find. Hmm. Cog.exe. I mean, what the heck is this? I wonder, is this the actual tunnel that's gonna take us all the way at the top? Office access, firewall exit. Can I climb up there? It doesn't look like we can climb all the way up there, which is really weird. So it should be a checkpoint here, which apparently we activated. That is really weird. What the heck is happening here? Oh, that's an AI driven antivirus. Can I shoot it? Do I still have the gun? I better see clear. It's a what now? Ben, hush! The cyber version of the base is represented as a Unix system. I know it, but I need to concentrate. Can I shoot it? No, it doesn't like we got the guns anymore. So I'm not quite sure what I gotta do here. Oh god! Crap, I think we gotta jump uh, over it. Hold up, let's try this again. So if I go all the way up here, that's gonna be the barrel. Whoa, these things are actually coming after me. Alright, what if I try to go through here then? Is he gonna keep on chasing me, seriously? Oh my god, it's actually chasing me. I think, yeah, this seems to be a dead end, so what the heck am I doing here? No! Wow, alright, so we got away from that. Yeah, I think we're good. I think this is where we. Oh, crap. I don't want to get my little sub legs tangled in that nasty looking corruption. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to not let you do that. Hold up, let's try to climb up there. There you go, buddy. Got the checkpoint. This place is security for the entire complex. Then probably shouldn't be in here. Nothingness of it all is sending a tingle right through me. I should do way more healing trespassing once the apocalypses are over. Oh crap! Damn, please don't forget I can't hear you. Oh crap, no, no, I know, I know, I know, no. Come on, buddy. Dang it, these things are actually coming after me. They're no joking. Right, right, right. Come on, buddy. Let's keep going. So, where is this gonna take me to? I think I just saw... Man, if I were a nerd, all these emails would probably make interesting reading. <laughs> Fortunately, I'm cool now, so we'll breeze past them. Without a care in the world. Take that, school system. You don't need so-called reading when you can't... when you can wall climb. Ah, oh, wait! There's exposition? <laughs> read it out! Read it out! <laughs> no time, buddy. Gotta keep moving. Oh, wait, what happened? This should be the VR suit. Where Ben is. Hello? What? Where are you? I wonder if I can set up a bypass from here to hack the, the security protocols and get us access to the next room. Hmm... What am I supposed to do here? I can't pick him up now. This is not where I am. I'm up in the VR helmet. This nonsense body is all... Is all ones and zeros. No good for lifting. Hmm. Oh! Right, I managed to break through the construct in the security grid and unlock the door. Oh, so I think we're gonna just go back to Ben here. 
Right, I managed to break through the construct. Oh, there we go. We got it. Into the security grid and unlock the door. Wait, how did you... What? Uh, nothing? Never mind. <laughs> what was the construct like? It was like the ones we've been doing, only the graphics were even older. Blimey. Alright, so we got past this uh, puzzle here. Let's keep going. Actually, hold up. Let's just drop this guy and see what we can interact with here. Look at it. It's a brain in a jar. Fast asleep. Hooked up to loads of corpses in other jars. Today doesn't seem to be getting any easier. I should find some way to wake it up so I can pester it with questions. Uh, talk to. Hello, brain? Piss off. <laughs> Must be sleeping. Huh. Hold up. Did I drink? Yuck. I'm not drinking fluids that had brains floating around it for god knows how long. Hmm. Okay, so we have a checkpoint all the way up here. Ooh, there we go. Interesting. Unfortunately, we cannot get past this. We cannot shoot it either. Crap. Alright, uh, can we then shoot this? No. Can we shoot those things? No. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I can do anything here. So let's just switch back to Ben. Let's see, what else? Let's just try to use something in the inventory, I guess. I don't know. Uh, what if I try to use... This? It doesn't need braining. Uh, use... This? That doesn't need braining. Uh, let's have a chat with uh, Dan here, then. What are we doing? We need to find some more RAM. Again. Alright, so, uh, hope the apocalypses don't kill us. Well, right. I mean, me too, obviously. <laughs> I don't think I got what I need here in order to use the brain. Uh, we didn't find the ram. Uh, let's just switch back to this guy and teleport right over here. Let's see. Can I talk with the mechanic? We found a VR suite. Then did the insecurity level. Yes, the old maintenance experience still work. So I assimilated that emotion. Thank you. Was it better than my construct? I feel like they had this tactile and greedy feel that I can never capture. Nah, no way. And you're not just saying that? Dan Defo said something about it having too many dimensions. Well, okay then. Thanks. Alright, how does it look, topside? <laughs> Are the apocalypses still going on? Uh, sadly, yes. London is largely lost. Squished bit by a horde of massy bees. Looks like America is turned upside down. A little village just west of the Birmingham has got away on Sky. Oh, oh no. Wait. Uh, fell into the sun. Gone. Oh yeah. So, nope. Not brilliant, if I'm honest. <laughs> Alright, how are you finding insecurity? I honestly don't know how you people live like this. Nah, me neither. <laughs> Alright, um, bit much. So, apparently we are kind of done here. Hmm. What if I try to climb all the way up here? It doesn't like I can grab to this um, right side. Hold up, can I maybe shoot that? Hmm. It doesn't like I can shoot anything here, so that is really weird. Okay, in that case, all we gotta do next is just teleport all the way back here. Alright, let's see if we can find anything else. Let's try using the gun, right? Oh, hold up. We found another one of these things. So let's just teleport with Ben and read it out loud. Let's see, what do we got here? Use. Alright, my very good fellows. 
It pleased me not a little to introduce our newest marvel of science, the Luxo Mail. These letters of light will lighten your breeches. Your assured friends, Redrek, Deputy Lord of Scientific Progressions, I trust you shall consider their environment and refrain from transcribing this Luxo Mail. Alright, uh, let's switch back to this guy and keep exploring, I guess. Oh, another one! Interesting! How many of these did I miss? Apparently quite a few. Uh, let's use this one as well. Dear all, it has long been tradition to induct the occasional celebrated creative into our organization. I've always turned a blind eye to the bizarre inclination of many of these artists to hide references to our existence in their works, as there have been several about it. However, I want to see Stanley's latest film last night and it was absolutely jam-packed with obvious allusions to maintenance. This is unacceptable, so I'm creating a new perpetual edict, no more outsider inductions. Thanks, Jack. <laughs> Alright, so, um, hmm, what else do we have around here? Doesn't look like we can shoot anything, so I'm not quite sure what's happening. Hold up, let's just shoot this and go through here. There we go. Alright, let's teleport Ben. Alright, buddy, let's have a read. My own colleagues, this night at 7 o'clock, the most recent of our uh, celluloid performances shall be projected for the enlightenment of the mechanism. Our fellows in the Department of Sight and Sound have contrived to make this tale plain for all to see. I therefore bid you attend, tripping up and pretending that you did not, a record of feeling in one. Hmm. Isabel. Ah, oh, crap, I didn't want to kill him. <laughs> Right, sorry about that, buddy. Happened again, did it? Sorry, I was just trying to protect you from a bad, uh, from a daddy. Won't happen again. <laughs> all right, um, let's just drop you all the way here. Let's see what we can do here. He was just trying to protect us from a baddie. Seriously, buddy. You know what? Maybe we can combine some things together. I don't even know. Drink. Yuck. Not drinking fluid that's had brain floating around him for good how God knows how long. Uh, use eventry. Can I use this on? Does need brain ink. I mean, I guess I can try to use everything here. Does need brain ink. What about the lollipop? Uh, what about the bra? I guess this is the only thing we can use. Besides, I can't imagine that makes it any sexier. Alright, so I'm pretty sure we cannot really do much with uh, Ben here, so let's see. Let's try with Dan then. I mean... Ah, uh, crap. Never mind. I mean, I know that we could simply go all the way up here. Now the question is... What am I supposed to do next? Oh, you know what? Hold up, I have an idea. There we go. So all we had to do is just try to get on this platform over here. Uh, let's try this again. There we go. Alright. Perfect. Uh, now, if I go down here, this is just gonna allow me to go down. Huh. Ooh, and now we open this up. Now we can pass through here if we want to. I wonder if... Hmm, apparently there's a code here. I wonder if I can bring Ben over here, though. Let's see, let's just try. Let's see, actually, I could have teleported him. God dang it. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can figure out this thing. Boring panel. It's a keypad for the door. A bit of boring weight. Open a door if you ask me. But, whatever. Maybe there's a way to blow it up instead. <laughs> ah, crap. Of course we gotta input some codes, which I have no idea what the code is gonna be. One, two, three, four, five, six? Yeah, that is not gonna work. Alright, um, in that case, I'm pretty sure... Crap, I didn't want to do that. Uh, let's try this again. I'm curious if I can get up here now. 
because it seems like we're gonna keep dying. Hmm. Hold up. So if I try to do this, there we go, we got it. All right, uh, next up. Next up, I think we gotta keep on climbing up here. Ah, oh, crap. Seriously? Hmm, I have a feeling I gotta press this for Ben. Yeah, he may need to pass. So let's just get Ben all the way up here. Alright, leave it here for a second because I am gonna have to go down here and press the button. There we go, now we can pass. Perfect. Um, hmm. Now he will allow Dan to cross easily. There we go. Oh no, it's a boring room full of facts. No, look, there's more of those gravity rips you love so much. Oh, hooray! It's the most exciting room I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Alright, so this will help me uh, save the game. Let's just... Grab you, buddy. Come on. Alright, I'm just gonna drop you here. Uh, let's see. I have to shoot all this stuff, though. Ah, crap. Dang it. Seriously? Did that just kill me? Or, never mind. I think we're good. Interesting. A-G-H-N-O-Z. I mean, I don't think Ben can do... I don't think Ben can do anything here. So I'm not gonna expect him to uh, be able to do anything good here. Ah, oh, crap. Dang it. I messed up. Seriously? <laughs> what the heck? One eternity later. Oh, you know what? I have a feeling I gotta jump on the wall and then try to climb that. I get it now. Dang it. Alright, let's try this again. There we go, there we go, we got it. Alright, cross, cross the pier. Oh, a bug! And it went to my mouth! <laughs> Alright, so we gotta do and then go to the right side. Oh, there we go, we finally got it. Uh, before we do anything though, let's just switch back to Ben here because I want to teleport him right here. Just in case we fall down. He's gonna have to be uh, my savior. Alright, so we got cross. And I have a feeling I need to get Ben here as well. Made it! Chuck up another one for all of me. <laughs> I'm sure I could get there by combining things and take talking to people, you know. <laughs> yeah, you wanna try? You are just going to teleport. I'm just going to teleport this time, but I want you to know that I could get there if I were actually bothered to apply myself. Okay, but anyway, look. Shut up. There's a ram up here, but... Hmm, blasted. Thing is stuck in the ground. Oh, no way. So apparently this thing about getting stuck in the ground isn't really a glitch. It's made intentional because I do need... I do need Ben over here. I need to place him right over here. And now we need to uh, use the glitch so that we can glitch in the ground. Look at that. <laughs> Are you for real right now? So this was not a glitch after all? No way, okay, that feels like... Whoa, is that allowed? That doesn't feel like it should be allowed. Don't tell anyone, I think we got away with it. <laughs> no way that was not a glitch. Seriously? I really thought that was gonna be a glitch, but anyway, I guess uh, I guess it's gonna be okay. Alright, um, let's switch back to Dan, carry this guy, and let's keep going. There we go. Let's drop Dan. Let's drop Ben. And use this. Huh. What did he do? Oh, we got back from the other side. No freaking way. And we just got away for the timer, I guess. Wow. 
Seriously? Come on, gate, open up. We need to cross. Oh, crap. <laughs> what? What about Dan? Huh. What about Ben? Why is he all the way over there? Anyway, I guess I'm gonna have him be saved right here. Get him back. And let's keep going. Alright, there we go. Uh, let's just drop him down because I'm not gonna be able to do this jump with him. <laughs> I mean, look at this glitch. I was never expecting this to work. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, I sort of feel like we don't need to do that anymore. Hmm, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I hope we don't have to do that anymore. Right, boys? What's happening? Did I just glitch the game or what the heck is happening? Alright, and we're back. I'm um, not quite sure exactly what the heck happened there. That was definitely a glitch. Um, yeah, I don't know what happened there. I couldn't really control the characters anymore. Come on, buddy. There we go. Alright, and let's get to here. Drop him down. Let's try to get out of here. There we go. Alright, and we can now easily uh, keep going. Go to our next uh, location. Oh, you're getting in. Are you? Are you sure that's safe? Um, yeah? Okay, good. Good. Fine. I'd better prep the next construct then. Just two little ones this time, okay? I hope I don't mess it up. <laughs> here you go. Alright, there we go. The uh, the next two constructs. So we got three more to go, actually. The thing is, I don't really know what to expect here. I don't know what uh, the next one is going to be like. Ooh, suffering. Oh my god, hold up. This one is going to be really bad. Uh, my head. Shh, wait a minute. My head's pounding so hard I can't move. And everything's too bright and loud and sepia. Oh no, I'm I'm hungover. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'm hungover. Me too. So shh. Fortunately, drunk me normally makes a cup of coffee for hungover me. Coffee is part one of a successful recuperation. Now, where did we leave it this time? Hmm. Oh, we're moving so slow. I think I'm gonna be violently sick. <laughs> Where is this damn music even coming from? It's everywhere. It's ambient. Who do that? Uh, huh. Uh, this noise is making my head pound. It's too loud. I'm not moving from this part until it's gone. Make it stop. Hmm. So, can I switch to anybody? Let's have a chat with... Dan. Oh, hold up. Can we use the inventory and put this on our heads? Is this gonna cover the music? It doesn't look like it's covering it, eh? Yeah, it doesn't look like it's really covering it. No, let's have a chat with him, then. Hey, Dan? Not today, thank you. Make that music stop, will you? Hmm, how am I gonna do that? Because apparently... Don't really want to cross here. Huh. What? How am I supposed to cross here then? Look at this, not even this young person music. I can't bear to move from a safety of my bed area, which this racket which is rack is going on. Turn it off, turn it off, someone please! Now the thing is, we cannot really switch to Dan, we cannot control him. Um Look at, it's Dan. He's hungover. Must have overdone it last night. Stop making noises. Hmm. Can I use this? Where? I have to remove the uh, other one first. Alright, uh, remove this one then. And where this? Alright, let's see. Is this gonna cover my ears? I think I'm going to be violently sick. Where's this damn music coming from? Alright, so this is not working. Hmm. Hold up, you know what? I have an idea. I think I've done something like this in Monkey Island. So let's just try. Let's see if we go in the options here. In the auditory, if I lower down the music volume, 
Is this gonna help? No way. Ah, oh, thanks for that. With the noise gone, I think I can at least walk without wanting to vomit. <laughs> I'll wait here and vomit. <laughs> no way that worked. Seriously? God dang it. That took me quite a while to figure out to tell the truth. Oh, what? Ugh. Oh. I don't feel too good. I know I shouldn't have had that 8 sherry. You had the 8 sherry on your cork flakes in the morning. I know, that was the start of my downfall. <laughs> no way. I think we're gonna have to get to the coffee in order to get better. Hold up. Come on, buddy. You can do it. You can do it. Come on, keep crawling. You got this. Is this gonna make me feel better, th better though? Nope, that's it. That's as far as I can go. So close, but sadly, I'm spent. I will lie here forever, and then just die. It seems fair. Bye then. Bye! <laughs> socket. Hmm. We got a socket here and the coffee mug. I definitely want the coffee mug. Can't reach. Uh, what about the socket? Can I... Put my fingers in, flip the switch, but nothing plugged in. Alright, uh, can I maybe use the wire with that? That will conduct the electricity alright, but currently it will just conduct it straight into me. Hmm, currently, like electrical current? <laughs> oh, my head. Huh, so what else can I do then? Can I use this with it? The socket is perfectly functional. Unlike me. What? Um, flip the switch, but nothing's plugged in. What? Should I plug something in? I, I don't get it. That is not gonna work. We already uh, gone through that. I'm pretty sure that is not gonna work either. Placing all electrical sockets, not a good idea. Which I quite initially seen because I was drinking all night. Actually, ugh. <laughs> uh, you know what? Maybe I need to look at it. Yeah, let's just look at it first. Power socket switching on makes power come out. Beyond that, I don't understand. So that is not gonna work. Uh, what about this? Mm, no. Seriously? I mean, I don't really... Oh, can we put this in then? A flow of electricity. But get this arm flexed. But just uh, swapping the width against the power socket just won't activate that. Huh. What? So a flow of electricity might get this arm flexing, but just slapping the wet and the wet end against the power socket won't ac achieve that. Uh, what if I try to plug this into the arm? Oh, there we go! I knew it. That arm's fine motor function can now be controlled with electric impulses, just like a real arm. Hmm. And what if I try to connect it now to uh, the sockets? That's a good idea. The wire will conduct the electricity and cause the hand to cause to close shut. That should get it into position first, though. Oh, I should get it into position first. Um, in that case, what we need to do is switch the mug here. And now connect this to the mug. Perfect. Now to get the fingers to move. Interesting. I can still access the wire from my inventory. <laughs> All right, and if I use the wire actually not on the mug, I need to use the wire on the plug. Use. If I'm doing inventory on arm stuff, it needs to be done in my dedicated inventory screen. Wait, what? Oh, we need to go into the power socket. There we go. And now I use this. I'll just make sure it's off first. Don't want any electric whoopsies. Ready to go. Wish me luck, me. <laughs> good luck, Ben. Thanks, Ben. I guess the good thing about seeing double is there are two of me to help solve puzzles. Hmm, I helped a bit. <laughs> Alright, use the power socket. Probably no one can tell apart from me. But the hand's teeny tiny fingers have successfully grabbed hold of the mug. Sweet. Sweet caffeine relief on its way. <laughs> Bring it here, please, as soon as possible. Alright, uh, let's just grab the arm now. Look at that, we got it! Oh, thank god. Liquid coughing. And step one of my patented perfect hangover cure. Oh no, now I have to move. 
<laughs> Alright, I think uh, we got rid of this construct. This was definitely short. Awesome. Suffering complete. Look at that. Alright, and let's see uh, what's gonna be uh, the next one. I'm pretty sure we're not done here yet. Yep, there we go. We got hope next. So the uh, mechanic was right when saying that these are gonna be uh, short. Oh, this construct simply oozes pathos. Does it? Yeah, it does, Ben. I can practically feel the pathos running through my veins. Th something mysterious and intriguing is happening. Oh no, it's a walking simulator. Amazing, it's a walking simulator. Can't wait to have my expeditions about narrative tested. I'll take charge. You follow on after. Can I have a piggyback? I can't very well drink in the emotional majesty of a meticulously constructed interactive exploration. Which you, jabbing your fingers in my eyes and farting on my back. Can I? <laughs> Fine, I'll automate. Just this once. Then we go back to the talking turns. Wait, you can do that? Of course I can do that. When the terrain is, uncompl is uncomplicated enough, I just generally choose not to. <laughs> oh, so he's just gonna follow me. Seriously? Alright. She took my hand, and suddenly I understood. Like got a genie hit me. It wasn't about it yesterday. It was about the tomorrows we'd never forgotten. Whoa, so very deep and meaningful. So full of context and sharply observed prose. Such bullcrap. <laughs> uh, let's see, what does this say? The rain batters my face like the tears of grieving mother. Like of a grieving mother. I realize that memory goes forward and back, riding its gears along the face of forever. What the heck was that? Aw, oh, Ben, you're such a lily. <laughs> Didn't you pick up on multiple layers of nuance? Silence. I prayed for silence. I clawed at my face, but the car wouldn't stop. How should he stop? When the screams came from his sides. What? Are these getting worse somehow? <laughs> Are these getting better somehow? Nope, definitely not. Alright, let's keep going then. At last the dragon was slain. The exhausted knight entered her nest and collapsed. All around him, the tuned radio whisper, the screams of the lost friends. Oh, that one was magnificent! I'm really beginning to piece together an intriguing narrative here. Are you? All I'm getting is desperate chunks of waffle. <laughs> But we had made something, her and I, and it was a shared love for our progeny that will carry this world through. Huh. Giant foreign slabs of text are just the worst way of conveying a narrative. None of it hangs together at all. What does any of all this even mean? Well, it's... isn't it obvious? Nope. No, it's not. Get to fill me in? Uh, ben. Well... If you can't figure it out yourself, I can't help you. You mean you don't know? Of course I know. I'm an indie darling. It's like a fifth sense to me. Fifth sense? Yeah, no longer have the sense of tongue. Which one is that? The sense of talking? I no longer have the sense of talking. Yeah, I picked up I picked up on that. Come on, let's keep going. Um, alright. Let's see, what next? I have a feeling we're gonna have to do a lot of these walking here. I climb, I climb, I climb. The crown of the granite arch meets me. The waterfalls rinse off my sins. Whoa, this is all really coming together now. I didn't even bother reading that one, to be honest. <laughs> Was it crap? Well, I think this whole narrative has been utterly stunning. Simply stunning. Lost now, forlorn and forgotten. But with the new rebirth, a chance of slate afresh, and a horizon ripe with the summer fruits of yesterday's tomorrow. Perhaps here, the sunsets will glitter that much sweeter. I hope this ends soon. <laughs> there we go. I think we got it, right? Alright, construct complete. Assimilating. Data, what was this one? Hope. There we go. We are definitely done.
Alright, then we're back to the mechanic. Lady Nora, I don't know which construct was worse. Suffering or hope? Suffering? I wasn't in suffering. Must have been a fake before the construct. I got relaxation, it was lovely. That back message really hit the spot. After pushing around those heavy crates, I'm lugging a whole hanky on a stick around. And I'm concentrating on puzzles like half of the time. Where's my back rub? Hey, mechanic! How come Dan got a day spa? And I got 12 pints of vodka poured down on my encephalon. <laughs> well, it might have had something to do with you being mean about my grief construct. Which, by the way, you got free of charge. And he's saving the human race. Ah, look, if you can't handle direct unsolicited negative feedback and personal attacks, you shouldn't be making construct in the first place. I like it, the mechanic. <laughs> Yeah, it's just the negative reviews stick with you more, you know. Okay, I reckon we're getting there. I've got one more big construct for you, and it's the most important of all. But first, I need some more RAM. Yeah, yeah, RAM, we get it. Alright, so look at that. Now, if you look down below here, you can see that we got one more construct to make, and of course, one more RAM to find. Um, which is gonna be a little bit difficult. I have no idea exactly what I gotta look next for that But anyway, you know what guys? I think uh, we are done with this one for now I think we're out of time and when we come back in the next one We are gonna keep exploring and I have a feeling that the next episode is actually gonna be the last one After we find the last ram and finish up with the last construct. I believe that's gonna be the end of it I'm not sure anyway as usual. Thank you all very much for watching another episode of layer of the clockwork God. I hope you enjoyed this and of course if you did a like would be much appreciated And if you guys are new here and have subscribed yet Please consider doing that as I'm posting videos just like this one every single day playing many more indie adventure games and puzzle games I'm pretty sure you'll enjoy please stay safe, and I'll see you all in the next one soon Bye